Family and friends of a man who was missing for six years say their final goodbyes. After David Raymond's mysteriously disappeared, his body was found earlier this year. News Channel 5's Alexander Cohen shows us how he is being remembered. David was well known for his stonemason work and his art, which is why it was on display here at his memorial. Music, a disco ball, and a good time. David Raymond's friends say this is how he'd want to be remembered. David was a hippie in that, you know, love was in his heart. I, you know, I think that was really what motivated a lot of his interactions with people. David lived in a tree house on Donald Nestle's farm in Wilson County. I miss shooting pool. I miss, I miss being able to rack up a game of nine ball with him. But, you know, hey, David, ka -ching. what about, you know, best out of five? And we'd just drop what we were doing and and play three games or four games of pool. He choked up as he remembered his friend. You live with all your memories, but I can see him in the room. In August of 2012, David went missing. His truck was found at the Dollar General store in Watertown. That morning, he told Nestle he was supposed to meet with a client who wanted stonework done, then go visit family in Michigan. Waved the sketch pad and said, you know, whatever you do, don't forget your paperwork. See you later and his bag of clothes to go to Michigan was packed. David never returned. In January of this year, his body was found in a wooded area in Wilson County. There is not a belief in my body that he was innocently there of his own volition. While how David died remains a mystery, there's one thing his friends know for sure. We're just scratching the surface here of the people that he's touched. David's family and friends are putting together reward money in case anyone has information on what happened. The Wilson County Sheriff's Department says there are no updates on the case.